Today we'll be going over how to do this viral glitch effect that Cole Bennett and his team pulled off for Lil Yachty's and Ian's Hate Me video. Here on the screen is our website, www.b3-studios.com, where you're going to find plenty of Final Cut Pro plugins. Some are free and some you have to pay for, but all in all, they will help you with your everyday Final Cut Pro workflow. Let's get into the video for today. Okay, so to start off this effect, what we're going to do is we're going to start off by creating a duplicate. So we're going to just hold Option and drag up to create a duplicate clip. And before we do that, actually, let's just play this video out. Let's just see how it's looked so far without the edit. And we're just gonna kind of make little Yachty glitch right here, very simply. So after you create your duplicate clip by holding Option and dragging up, you are then going to create a mask. So um, you're gonna create a mask around your object and make sure this is shot on a tripod as well. And actually, I'm just gonna put a shape mask instead of a draw mask. So I'm just gonna fit that around little Yachty. As best as possible and make sure while he's moving, he stays in the frame. Let's see how this looks so far. Whoa. I'm going to disable this clip at the bottom, V. So our subject is fully in frame. Perfect. Now, what we're going to do is we are going to go about two to three frames. We're going to go about two to three frames into your clip. So one, two. And you're just gonna cut the clip and you're gonna delete the rest of this clip right here. And now we should just have the beginning of this clip right here, just that small portion. And we can go ahead and um, undisable the bottom clip, V. So now what we're gonna do here is we're gonna zoom in a bit to our first, to our clip that's on top that's masked. And we're just going to create duplicates of this. So we're just going to drag. We're going to hold option and drag up or to the side or any direction is going to create a duplicate. And we're just going to keep doing this. I'm going to keep doing that a couple times. And once you play this back, you're going to have your effect. So once you create a couple of duplicates, that looks really nice. So once you create a couple of duplicates, you can just highlight the rest, copy those, and bring that back out. You can even be creative and add like a space here, a little space, so it can stop and then start back up. So um that's it for today guys so i hope this video helped you out guys if this video helped you out please like and subscribe um we will be coming out with a lot more content just like this and if you guys are interested in any other effects or how to do any other effects please comment below and engage with the channel because it helps the youtube algorithm i appreciate you guys and i will talk to you guys soon all right thank you bye